I like to pleasure people and be pleasured. I just don't chat. I meet. I want to know. If I meet you, you will let me pleasure you? Haha, <laughs> sounds fun. Look at this. We got these sweet new chairs. Sit down. It's so cool. It has like a massager in it. If you push those buttons, yeah. I got him to sit in the chair and I was just sitting on the edge of my chair. That's pretty cool, right? That's wow. <laughs> and then out of nowhere, he just stood up and started heading towards me. Do you want me to get you something to drink? He was definitely headed towards me for something. Jen, have a seat right over there where you were. Please. No. What's happening? Please, sit down. What's going on? I thought this was never going to happen. You thought this was never going to happen? Yeah. And what do you think this is? It's not, it's not good. Now what was your plan here tonight? Have a, have a, have a fun uh, time. Have a fun time? Yeah. With a girl who told you she was how old? I think it was uh, 13. And how old are you? 34. And during that drive at all, did you think, man, this was a bad idea? Yeah, that's exactly what I thought. She did not turn around. I should have thought about it. Have you met other people before on the internet? Sure, consent. Older. I mean, everybody's old, you know, that I've been. I've never done this before. What, what made you decide to do this for the first time tonight? You know, I, wow, it crossed my mind. I've I seen this show and I'm like, I you see, you see, You've seen which show? This one. This show? Yeah. And what was your reaction when, you, when you've seen the show before? It was bad. It's just, it's just bad. That's bad. all I can say. The, what the people were doing was bad. Yeah. Now, you say here that. You like to pleasure people and be pleasured. Yeah. Now you know this is a 13-year-old girl. Yeah. You talk about how having sex for the first time may be painful for the girl. And then you sent these pictures. Yeah. You ever been in trouble before? You have been. Yeah. What was the actual criminal charge against you? Having sex with a minor. Having sex with a minor. Yeah. Okay. That's right. Minor. He's a convicted sex offender. In 1995, he pleaded guilty to one count of unlawful sexual intercourse. He says it was a big misunderstanding that the girl showed him a fake ID saying she was 18. Well, you've seen the show before. So you know that, that this is about the time where I need to tell you who I am. I'm Chris Hansen, and I'm with Dateline NBC. Yeah. And this is to catch a predator. Sheriff's office, come on down. Come on. Jay, throw up where you can see up. See palms, palms, all the way down, all the way down. Come on. And what were your intentions when you got here? I was intentions to be pleasurable and pleasure her, but I, I might not have done the actual penetration. I just, I just wanted to see how it went. That's all. You know. Okay. No, you're gonna have to define pleasurable for me. Palatio, having the lady have pleasure below, and likewise, I guess. He says he lives with his girlfriend and her five-year-old son. Does she know uh, you chat? Yes, yeah, but she didn't know about this. So I told it was a couple. A couple. A couple. Two people. A man and a woman. That you were coming to see. Yeah. For what? I have pleasure with couples. So she knows that you travel to have relationships. He tells the agent about his prior conviction for sex with a minor and says he got probation. But later he was arrested for not reporting to his probation officer. So I went back and done 37 days in the pen in Delaware. He also admits to dating a teenager. He says she was 18, but he doesn't remember her name. You lived with this girl and you didn't know her name. I've had a lot of girlfriends. Well, I'm sure you have, Travis, I but I want to know this one's name. I don't know. I can see her face, but I just, I can't picture her name. How long did she live with you? A couple months. Like all the other men arrested here in Kentucky, he Thank pleads you. not guilty.